A historical moment in Carter County today. Good evening, I'm Terry Craig. A portrait more than 200 years old is unveiled at the Sycamore Shoals State Park Visitor Center. It's of Landon Carter. He's the patriot that Carter County is named after. News Channel 11's Jayana Scurry shares how Sycamore Shoals got the portrait in its possession. The story of Landon Carter starts at the Watauga Settlement. That's right here, what we now know as Carter County. Landon, just like any other man here in, in the settlement, was part of the military, the militia. He rose in rank in both civil and military affairs, served in the Revolutionary War, and then he became very involved in Tennessee politics when it was established in 1796. When the town of Elizabethan was established, his wife Elizabeth was where the namesake of the town came from. So that just tells us how precious they were and important they were to the community and to the formation of this nation back in the late 18th century. A war hero, a community leader, Landon Carter quickly made an impact in the Watauga settlement. We're starting to come into what became the Watauga settlement and Landon's father John became a strong community leader. Landon basically followed in his footsteps. After many years of private ownership of the portrait, descendants of Carter decided to sell the portrait to Sycamore Shoals. It took Kim Gwynn over 100 hours to restore the painting. When I received the painting, it was extremely dark, very heavily soiled. The varnish that was used, I was hoping that it was, would be very uh, easy to remove. It appeared to me a, a linseed oil varnish, which is a big mistake. The linseed oil had turned very dark, gray green and, and took a lot of effort to remove. Linseed oil is very difficult to remove from any surface, much less a painting. The signature was not found on the artwork, meaning the artist of the portrait is unknown. Gwen's final touches was to apply a new layer of varnish. A hundred years from now, if somebody wants to remove that varnish, they can if it collects any dust or dirt. 